by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, there will not be hindrance. We should not be strange. We should not be a stranger to this message. God that empower Paul by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ is going to empower us. His grace will be sufficient for every one of us. The question we need to ask ourselves, the Almighty Father, how far have I gone in preaching to other people, in preaching in my house, in preaching to my friends, call upon the name of the Lord, the Almighty Father, help me, O Lord. We now call upon the name of the Lord, that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, as this week has started, by the power and the blood, you will receive before. I will receive before. Let's call upon the name of the Lord, that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, before we meet you, before we meet me, where we have never expected that the grace of the Lord will be sufficient for us. Pray, 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 pray for you. For let me see. What is that thing that is bothering you? What is that particular thing that is heavier, heavier in your head? I want you to know Jesus Christ is there for you. Call upon him. The Almighty Father, I call upon you and see if he's not going to answer. I trust him. We are the one that is failing him. He has never failed us. Call upon the name of the Lord, that by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, God will empower you to do evangelism, to invite other people to the church. Know that you will play game with them only, not that you will play Ludo with them only, not that you will eat with them only. You will tell them to come to the church. Let's call the name of the Lord that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, the next meeting, we will see any part of this in our life in Jesus' name. And the name of the Lord shall be glorified. So shall it be. In Jesus' name we pray. Our mighty Father, we glorify your name because of the sin of today. We thank you, Lord, because you refresh our mind about thanksgiving. Almighty Father, here we present ourselves by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. You will uphold us in Jesus' name. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, no one among us will run away from you in the name of Jesus Christ. And we will continue to uphold your hand. You continue to uphold us in your hand, and we shall not fall. We shall not fail in Jesus' name. Anywhere we find ourselves, the name Jesus Christ will be mighty. People will see it in our life in Jesus' name. So shall it be. In Jesus' name we pray. Let us be seated. I don't know that, I don't know if everyone of us observed, almost everyone of us were so strong. Almost 100% is sleeping. That is not fair. The Akim may have been telling you about adjusting your time, especially on Sunday. So God will be with us in Jesus' name. Rademantry, I observe you too. I observe myself. Uh, uh, sister, the only thing is that you do not concentrate so much. And then, uh, my daughter, you too. And then uh, the big boss. So uh, let us adjust. Go with you. And then I can me, I've been telling you when somebody is a leader, people look at you and the art in that way. I've told you in the corridor, I've told you in corner, I'm turning you in the open, openly now. God will help you in Jesus' name. Uh, we have seen what Pastor Dada did for us. 
uh, as at now, we have not, he has not told us, although he said we should go and take insurance on the name of the church on it. So he has not told us, but maybe he's giving us that one permanently, or he's going to buy another car for us. But as far as now, until he commented again, he has given us that one. And that one, let us avoid the problem of uh, whereby we squeeze ourselves in full swaging. Even when we have the uh, Toyota, Toyota's uh, Sierra. So this one can occupy more people. I pray that God will continue to be with him. The grace of the Lord will continue to be with him in Jesus' name. Uh, there was an accident yesterday, not an accident like that, where we went to share the food. And then my, we saw the card, we saw everything, and it was turning. Let's continue to pray that by the power and the blood of Jesus, that God will touch the mind of the person and then bring it back uh, to us in Jesus' name. Uh, we couldn't see Martha. I think on Monday, she said we should come and pick her, but unfortunately, uh, we couldn't make it. I don't think, I think we didn't have Bible study on Monday. Uh, okay. So please call her again, Brad Dimitrik. Uh, Moya, we didn't even work on, uh, on him. And that one bit to Sister Lisa. I don't know. Did you talk to him yesterday about the church? Okay. So. So let us continue that. I know James will be in the church tomorrow, and uh, what is his name? Uh, and let us thank James. James followed me to Washington, D.C. to pick the boss. So go. Yeah. God will continue to be with him in Jesus. And Pastor Dada, extend greeting. He's low. I'll probably he look at the video, and then he can't help anyone first. And then he was happy. I pray that the grace of the Lord will continue to be upon us. Do not let us relent. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, in all our point of need, God will be with us in Jesus' name. I've always been telling you all the ministry of each individual is quite a difference. Uh, yes, we are looking at the pastor that, that pastor that, that can help compare himself with our GS. Yes, we are looking at uh, Pastor Charles. Pastor Charles can never compare himself with Pastor Dada. Yes, we are looking at Pastor Folayan. Uh, Pastor Folayan can never compare himself with uh, Pastor Dada. So uh, the ministry God has given the Bindua is quite different. So all what you need to do is that whatever God has given to you, hold it well. Hold it well. God will not blame you for not uh, be Pastor Dada. Only what he's going to blame you for it's not using your talent very well. And we can see it in the life of the servants uh, the, that received the five talent, the one that received the three talent, the one that received the first talent. The same heaven, the one that received five talent went, is the same heaven, the one that received three talent went. The only thing that happened to the, the one that collected uh, that. Uh, receive one talent is that he buried it. He didn't use it. Let's say he used it, he will have gone to the same heaven with them. So whatever we follow, if inviting people you can do, please invite them. The other lady has moved to another place. So that's why we are not saying uh, we are uh, following somebody up in his place. But the power and the blood of Jesus, I will not let that one stop me. God will help us in Jesus' name. Uh, do we have any question? If not, we have a bunch of cloths outside there. So please, check whatever you want there and pick. Uh, God will help us in Jesus' name. Uh, if there's any other thing, I uh, will let us know. Do not forget Bible study tomorrow. Do all what you can do to invite at least one person. One person. Do not let us uh, relax. God has been helping us, and He will continue to help us in Jesus. That's why He was very happy to release the bus for us, and God will continue to help us in Jesus' name. Let's bring our tithe and offering. Let's open our Bible to the second book of, I mean, 
the second book of Paul to the second uh, to Corinthians. That's second Corinthians chapter nine verse seven. Second Corinthians chapter nine verse seven. I want someone of us one of us to read it. This way first find it, read it. Second Corinthians chapter nine verse seven. Whosoever find the read it. I come here, me check their Bible where they are opening. Says Salisa, why are you not opening your Bible? Second Corinthians. Read, uh, sorry. And let us continue to pray that God will send more workers and that God will help us in this church. Second Corinthians chapter 9, verse 7. Read, sorry. Read. Read it. That's me because your reading was better before. That's when you have not been reading your Bible again. Your reading was was better than this before. So you need that's when you need to be reading your Bible again. But your Bradley metric read for us. Second Corinthians chapter nine, verse seven. Every man according as he purposes in his heart, so let him give, not grudgingly or of necessity. For God loves a cheerful giver. Let's bring our titan offering. In Jesus' name we pray. Our mighty Father, we thank you, Lord, because of what you are doing for us in Charlotte. You do not look at our number, you do not look at our wisdom, you do not look at our knowledge, you do not look at our understanding, you do not look at our righteousness. We are not boasting of sin, O oh Lord, but we just want to appreciate you for everything you are doing in the life of each individual. Father, accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Father, out of, out of what you are giving to us, we bring this little token. Let it be acceptable before you in Jesus' name. And let your name be glorified. Almighty Father, we bring Bible study of tomorrow unto your hand. All people we do not see today by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, they will join us in Jesus' name, and our joy will be full. Thank you, Lord, because you are the Lord that answer prayer. In Jesus' name we pray.
so Brad Metric make it uh, mandatory for you to call uh, Mata. Uh, okay. And then Brad Sister Lisa, make sure you Moya is here tomorrow. Okay. Uh, for all the other people, we will continue to do our best and God will continue to help us in Jesus' name. Let's share the grace together. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Thank you. God bless you. We we'll see on on we we'll see uh, tomorrow. Please do not forget we have a lot of clothes there. Take whatever you want.